The Anglican Church has allowed women to become priests for the past two decades, but up until recently there's been resistance to women joining the clergy in southwest Victoria. Today, the Ballarat Diocese ordained two women as priests, casting off the title of one of Australia's most conservative districts. Jessica Tapp reports. This is the moment Robin Shackle from Warrnambool and Anne McKenna from Stall were ordained. Around 40 priests laid their hands on the women as part of a blessing where they were promoted from deacon to priest. It was wonderful to stand up and look out and see rows and rows of people from Warrnambool. People are very excited and very happy. And it's had a, it, it been wonderful throughout the whole diocese and well beyond the diocese. It's been 20 years since the Anglican Church first ordained women priests, but it's taken till now for South West Victoria to embrace the change. About time. Today, 2013, I'm sure that Jesus would approve of women being ordained. I know many women priests that are, are very, very good, so I just go with the punches now. I'm quite happy. This deeply conservative Anglican diocese is the last in Victoria and one of the final five in Australia to ordain women as priests. At a recent synod meeting in October, the majority of lay people overwhelmingly voted in favour of the ordination of female priests. However, around a third of the clergy are still not in favour of it. Though people may not be in agreement, it's all gone very smoothly. I guess for some people, they will not ever be comfortable with having women priests. Having taken 20 years to get this far, those reluctant to accept women priests have at least had time to get used to the idea. Jessica Tapp, ABC News, Ballarat.